It was a fall from grace that left the nation stunned. Aaron Hernandez was the New England Patriots' dynamic tight end until he was convicted of murder. Many of his secrets were lost forever when Hernandez took his life in his prison cell. But his attorney says the media has yet to paint an accurate portrait of his client. What's unique about Aaron is if you knew him, you would have a hard, a hard time not liking him. And I think that when you hear of all of these stories that have been previously reported, you're only hearing from people who didn't know the man. Uh, but I think in this, in this special, you're going to hear from quite a few people who actually knew Aaron and can tell you a lot more about him uh, and really give you an insider's perspective as to some of the events that, that uh, happened in his life. A two-part docu-series tells his story through the eyes of his attorney, his fiance, his former teammates, and the detectives who investigated his case. It also examines what we learned after Hernandez's death, that he, like many football players, was suffering from CTE, the degenerative brain disease brought on by head trauma. Jose Baez says the diagnosis explains a lot of Aaron's behavior. Now, I want to be clear, I don't believe that the CTE uh, is what made him a killer or anything like that. No one is saying that because I, I am a firm believer that Aaron was innocent uh, of these crimes. And But I do believe that they explain some of his behavior, some of his decision making, some of his uh, impulse, lack of impulse control. Doctors in Boston say Hernandez was suffering from the worst case of CTE they had ever seen in a person his age. And his lasting legacy may be his contribution to advancing research of the disease. Aaron Hernandez Uncovered airs on the Oxygen Network this weekend. For InsideEdition.com, I'm Mara Montalbano.